TikTok app that made videos stating that during a disaster, there won't be lawlessness. Hey, good morning or good afternoon, wherever you guys happen to be. Um, if you haven't seen Sam B. Reddy's uh, new, new video, he's talking generically about Hawaii. And some people were commenting that it's not going to be that much lawlessness if the power goes out. Um, and Sam was responding, yeah, there will. There, there could be very massive problems. It depends how it's um, handled. He's absolutely 100% right. Um, you look at the videos of Katrina. That was a nightmare. The crime, everything. Harvey, Ike, the other hurricanes I've lived through. Um, yeah, there is lawlessness. Understand when the Red Cross, FEMA, whoever comes in, they're going to come in specifically with an objective, right? So they will set up uh, medical centers. They will set up, you know, camps. They'll set up shelters, food distribution, um, and then they're going to try and get the infrastructure up, right? So the engineers, we would go to the water treatment plants, evaluate them, and report back to the civil engineers of the state of Texas. Hey, um, you know, this water treatment plant needs power. The equipment looks good. We have to flush it. Uh, this other one here is under two feet of water. That one's out of commission. That one's done. You're going to need bulldozers for that thing. Um, but we're going to be worried about infrastructure and the, and the facilities to distribute food to the public. The law enforcement's going to be in the same boat. So what's not going to be easily available is, oh my God, someone's kicking in my door at 2 a.m. I'm going to call 911 because 911 is going to be overrun. Most people don't keep the non-emergency dispatch numbers in their house. So they start calling 911 for everything and they flood 911. So one lesson, have the non-emergency numbers for law enforcement, fire, and EMS on your freaking fridge or in your phone or whatever. But two, understand that when the guard gets deployed, extra cops come in from out of town, whatever, for an emergency, their priority is to keep the highways clear, the hospital running, the medical centers running, the food distribution going, and prevent massive looting. They're not going to be able to respond to your home quickly. So you need to be able to do that. Secure your home, make it unappealing, get a big dog, get a pew, zap someone, whatever. Be ready to take care of yourself. It happened in Harvey, but it was much more organized. Katrina was a great example of what not to do during a hurricane uh, by the government. Folks, it's real. And uh, Sam's spot on. So if you can, check his original video. It's worth a listen. You guys take care.